Big new details on a teen facing a serious prison time for online threats to bomb religious sites. A plea deal could happen. Local 23's Derek Garcia was the only TV reporter in the courtroom and has in-depth details on what's next in this case. Because, yeah, you're right, Joel Hayden Shrimpshire's attorney and the district attorney's office agreed to push the state's case back to March of 2020 and let the federal prosecutors try their case first. The district attorney's office also confirming a plea deal is on the table. 18 year old Joel Hayden Shrimpshire is facing two terroristic threat cases, one in federal court and another here in Cameron County. The state's case has a heftier indictment because the hate crime enhancement on two counts. This means he's looking at more time in state prison than in the federal case against him. Joel Hayden Shrimpshire's indictment in both courts stem from alleged terroristic threats he made on Twitter. The threats are to mail a bomb to the Federal Reserve, set fire to mosques, and shoot up synagogues. Harlingen is a safer place with him in custody. In his bedroom, Harlingen police investigators found chemicals to build bombs, Nazi literature, books on white nationalism, and hundreds of images of hate on his cell phone and a newspaper article of the Oklahoma City bombing. This is somebody who is not only studying the craft of making explosives, mm -hmm. but um, in my mind sort of relishing the fact that it, it could happen, it happened this way and it, and it could happen again, and maybe that's a goal that he had at some point. Any plea bargain or plea agreement must be made known to the court before January 2nd of 2020. And neither court system wants him out because according to District Attorney Louis Science, Shrimpshire has the means, motive, and access to build a bomb within a matter of days. I mean, this gentleman is a real thing. You know, he had the, the ideology and the expertise to, to create a lot of, uh, to hurt a lot of people. In Cameron County, Derek Garcia, Local 23 News.